So what we're going to do is we're going to come over to my screen here. And we are actually going to start up in our dashboard. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys how to set up both your, your radio and your hotspot so you can actually shut it down remotely by using your radio. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to start by coming over to our configuration. Now, if you have to log in, you're going to have to log in. Uh, Pi-Star and Raspberry. Remember the, uh, the silent P in Raspberry. Uh, then what we're going to do is we're going to come over here to Expert. And under Expert right here, you will see Pi-Star Remote. Right here is, this is our remote configuration file that will allow us to control the Pi-Star from uh, the radio. So we have different radio networks. So first we're going to want to do is make sure it's enabled as true. You're going to want to put in your call sign, obviously, so that that way you are the one who's authorized to actually initiate these commands. Then what we're going to do is since we're on DMR, we're going to come down to DMR. DMR usually starts with a hashtag like this right in front of shutdown. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to remove this hashtag. And once we have all these settings set, we're going to click apply. It's that simple. Then what we're going to do is we're going to come over to our radio. And as you guys can see, let me expand this. We're going to create a talk group. We, this is our uh, code plug we created yesterday on the fly. And as you can see, we have a private call right here to 999-9996. That is six nines and then the number six. This will actually initiate a shutdown to your hotspot. And I will show that working here in a second. So what we did was we created a channel, Sky Shutdown. Just added it to Shutdown. And then that way, when we come over to our radio, let me get to the right zone. We go to our Shutdown. It says HS Shutdown. I know it says Missouri above it, but it says HS Shutdown. And when we initiate this, Nope. Secret not found because this radio probably has a different ID than what's running in that. But that usually initiates the shutdown. Uh, they're running on two different sets right now. But that will initiate the shutdown and uh, it will shut down your actual um, hotspot. So when you actually go back to your configuration page or try to load your dashboard, can't find the page. So as you see, that command just shut it down. And now my radio is saying repeater not found because the, the hotspot is shut down. I have mine in duplex mode. That's why you're actually seeing that. So now to physically actually restart my hotspot, I have to go over there and plug it back in, unplug it and plug it back in. But that is the, the quick raw rundown of how we'll actually set up your, um, your hotspot to shut down from your radio.